the Calcutta 200D. After a fishing trip, cleaning, and just basic maintenance, what I do, um, I usually rinse it on the mist setting on the faucet or the hose um, just to get all the salt water off and then I'll get a microfiber cloth and I'll clean. There's two screws on the outer part. There's one right here and there's one right here. These are the screws that you take off. You're going to take off this one and this one. Nothing else. Don't mess with the other screws here. Just these two. And this is going to give you access to your spool. And with the spool, you're going to pull that out. Now you have these parts here. And what I do is I get a Q-tip. And I'll clean all of these parts right here in case there's any dirt or sometimes you get moisture in these parts right here. This is and then I'm going to clean the inside of this here really nice. Sometimes if it's um, really dirty, you might want to get, like, um, put alcohol on the top of this, just rubbing alcohol to make it, you know, to get the grime off. I'll take a Q-tip and I'll also clean the level wine system here. Inspect your spool this part right here make sure that is pretty clean you can go over that with the clean and you also want to clean your brake system here nice and clean I'll take the oil that Shimano provides and I will put a drop on the bearing system there's a bearing in here a lot of times it's easier to just put a drop onto a cotton swab and rub that onto the bearing. And then I will take another cotton swab without oil on it. I'll pull off most of the cotton so that it's fairly thin almost like a stick just with a little bit of cotton here so I'm gonna put that directly in the middle here and just move it around collect all the dirt and grind but in the middle you want to keep that pretty clean um, because any kind of dirt or oil or anything that gets in there it fits so tightly with your spool that it can affect your your casting so you want to keep that really clean don't even take my spool and I want to put another drop of oil on this on this cotton swab and rub it onto the brakes the brake system here because that will give you a a free casting smooth um, reel. If it's not just a slight bit lubricated, if it's too dry or there's something in there, that's when you hear that that noisy casting, it's not very smooth, you'll get that screeching kind of it feels like something's wrong with, with the reel. Most of the time it's just that it's not cleaned and not very lightly oiled. I will put my spool back into the reel. What you want to do is make sure your thumb bar here is in the up position all the time. When you're putting your reel back together, keep it in the up position because if it's down and you try to put this part back on, then the clutch system won't engage. So you want to keep Put your screws back in. Spin it. 
make sure it's fine thumb works also you want to put maybe two drops of oil onto this level wine system inside to keep that after you clean it you want to keep it maybe two maybe three drops not too much so that your level wind is working just fine and if you spin it around a few times it'll it'll spread it around and you should be fine